Okay, guys, to solve this equation, you should visualize it as three blocks, and your eyes should always zoom into the x, but you don't want a negative x equals something, so the first thing you should do is add this whole block to both sides. So carry this thing down, and then add that complicated block. That will then give you this. And then on this side, when you add this complicated block, it would be 10, take away this complicated block, and then you add the exact same complicated block. Where if these two blocks are the same, they cancel each other out. The point is that if you add this complicated block, the point is that if you add this complicated block, all that's left would be a 10, because um, it, it would just kill off this complicated block. So now, your eyes should zoom into the x again. You want to get x on its own. The good thing is that x is already a positive, so you should kill off this 7. So in your mind, take away 7 from both sides. So 10 take away 7 would be 3. When you take away 7 here, it just it, it would just um, kill off this 7. So all that's left is this block. So that would be 2x plus 1 over 3. So now um, you want to... You want to um, kill off this 3 because because of this divide line you've got to visualize it as a bubble like this you want to get x on its own but x is trapped in this bubble the next thing you should do is to, is to kill off this 3 so in your mind uh, times both sides by 3 that will then give you this um, this times times this side by 3 so that would be 9 and then times this side by 3 it would just kill off what's at the bottom so all that's left is 2x plus 1 so now, now uh, you want to get x on its own, kill off the 1. So in your mind, take away 1 from both sides. When you take away 1 on this side, it would just be 8. And then take away 1 on this side, it would be 2x. Uh, again, your eyes should zoom into the x. You want to kill off this 2. So in your mind, divide both sides by, by 2. So you would carry this 8 down and then divide it by 2. Um, carry this thing down and then divide it by 2. Well, this thing here is just x. This thing here is just x. And then 8 divided by 2 is the number 4. So really, your answer is 4. Okay?